I hope you enjoy this video. Please check out my playlist, Evidence for Christianity, Evidence for the Bible, End Times, and the Book of Revelation. I'll leave the links in the description. Enjoy. So, we have a lot of slugs. As you can see, there's one. There's one. There's one over there. And we also have a lot of wolf spiders. So I'm curious if there's a correlation. I have caught a huge wolf spider. And now, I'm going to see if it will eat the slug. So here's the enormous wolf spider that we caught. There's my slug. Let's see what happens. Zach, what is this? It's right under his feet. Here, Uncle, can what are you doing? Record, well, I mean they... Record Ooh, through those. There's a huge slug right there. The slug went under the spider. And the spider just lifted his legs to let the slug through. So maybe... The slug's using the spider as shelter. <laughs> So I put a second slug in there. That one is moving all around in front of it and under it. The second one's been moving around it too, but uh, yeah, it will not eat a slug. So I figured I'd leave him in there for a couple hours, and I did. <clears throat> Both slugs are still there. One's hanging out in the water dish, the other one's over there on the edge. So I don't blame the spider for not wanting to eat them. They're nasty. Well, I think it's safe to say that wolf spiders do not like slugs. And uh, she has had a cricket and a fly since uh, I took the slugs out. So she was definitely hungry. She or he was definitely hungry. But uh, was not interested in the slugs. Thanks for watching. Please feel free to leave a comment. And if you want to connect with me, I have a public group on MeWe called Share Your Trade. I'll leave a link to that in the description below as well. Thanks for watching.